You're watching Realistic Fishing, and I just caught this fish. Keep it realistic. Let's get out to the end of this dock and do some bluegill fishing. Here's what I'm fishing with this evening. Power bait atomic fry. This is a three quarter inch bait with a one thirty second ounce jig head. Let's get it tied on and see if we can catch any bluegill off the end of this dock. You know what sucks? That eye on this hook is painted closed. I don't have anything to poke it with. My line is not strong enough to poke that out of there. I'm going to have to go get another hook or something. Otherwise, I can't even tie this on. All right, I got some eye fish jig heads. The eyes on these are never glued shut because these are unpainted. I'm going to wrestle one of these out of here so that I can use it to poke through the paint and actually tie my lure on tonight. That is some heavy duty paint. There we go, finally starting to get it chipped out of there. Got it. Well, there went a few minutes of wasted time. I might end up going with one of these iFish micro jig heads anyway. We'll see how this goes. I wasted about two hours today trying to catch a bass. I should have just went straight to the bluegill. All right, let's try this Powerbait Atomic Fry. We're going to fish it under a float, not quite as deep as I have it. Yeah, we'll go about 15 inches. Let's try that. I'm Wyatt. I'm Penelope. Keep it, it realistic. Anyone home? There's a nibble. couple little pecks at it. Let's raise the bobber up. Let's try it again. Oh, I had a bite. Set the hook and missed them. Let's check my fry and see if it's still on there. Come on, where are you? Do I need to go even deeper? Do I need to switch to crappie nibbles? I'm just not getting anything. Come on, delicious atomic fry over here. There's a little tiny tap. They let go right away. Atomic. Maybe on this side. I had a bite, but I didn't hook him.
This is really brutal. This is Ashton from Ohio. Welcome to Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. Got him. First fish of the night. Feels like a decent fish. All right. All right, it's something. Yeah, we got about a seven and a half inch bluegill here on the power bait atomic fry. At least I didn't get skunked. The dock light just came on behind me. That's how you know it's getting late. Let's see if we can get another one out here. There we go, fish on. Another bluegill, I suspect. Yeah, that's a pretty good sized fish. Very similar to that last one. Easy. Yeah, another seven and a half inch bluegill. I'll take it. This bobber is so hard to see. I need to get one of those light up bobbers if I'm gonna try fishing for bluegill at night. There's about to be a goose powwow over here. They're calling their friends over. I'm not getting any more bites. I'm about to take this bobber off and see what we can do without it. Hey guys, glad you could join me. This is Vincent from Fort Peck, Montana. And you're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. Fish. All right. Got one without the float. Let's get him over here into the light. Evening bluegill here. Easy. I'm going to let you go. Yeah, another seven and a half incher. Not bad. Let's try it again. That's three bluegill tonight. Now I'm fishing blind, just feeling for that bite. Here come more geese. This is the place to be if you're a goose. 
Wow, listen to them. Holy cow. Well, looks like that's all I got tonight. Three bluegill. Can you believe it? I can.